Now at five, the Sarasota school community dealing with a tragedy during the last week of school. This third grader right behind me hit and killed on his bicycle on his way to school this morning. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jameis Newler. And I'm Isabel Rosales. Wendy has the night off. The crash happened just a couple of blocks from the boys' school at Brentwood Elementary. ABC Action News reporter Jake Peterson spoke to the driver just hours after the accident. The boy was riding his bike to Brentwood Elementary and was going through this crosswalk right here when a driver turning onto Weber didn't see him and struck him. Yeah, I didn't even see the kid. The driver says it all happened so fast. He was sitting so low I couldn't see him in front of my truck. And then when I started going, I heard a noise and I looked back and I seen the kid just laying there and I got out and I tried to help him. I heard blood curdling screams. Margaret Davis lives near Weber Street. She came outside and saw nine year old Roman Miller on the ground. His sister and mother both in tears. I held her. She had um, walked by the ambulance and seen that they were doing chest compressions on her son, so she had lost it. Miller died shortly after the crash. He was only a few blocks from Brentwood Elementary School. The driver not facing any charges at this time. Troopers say drivers need to be extra cautious while school is still in session. They're doing everything they can not to be late. They've got their backpack on them. Most of them are trying to get there quickly and we just want to do everything we can to protect them. Friends making a makeshift memorial on the side of the road to remember the little boy who was about to finish third grade. Troopers are still investigating to see if charges need to be filed. I just wish that they weren't going through this because of me. Counselors will remain at the school the rest of the week. Reporting in Sarasota, Jake Peterson, ABC Action News.